Yo, what's up guys? This is Midnight Wabbit, and welcome back to another Destiny video. Today what I have for you guys is just a quick little Voidwalker gameplay in the background while I'm talking about some of the buffs that they added to the Voidwalker in the April update. Now, uh, the first thing we're going to talk about is Embrace the Void, which causes this right here. As you can see, I can heal myself with my grenades now, which you could not do with Voidwalker before the update. So, basically, Embrace the Void before the update used to read something along the lines of damaging an enemy with a grenade or Nova Bomb will trigger the energy drain effect. So, you know, it's not too bad, but the energy drain effect wasn't very good before the April update. That's another thing I want to talk about. The energy drain has been buffed majorly, so it's actually a noticeable difference to your grenade cooldown now. And there's multiple ways to trigger it besides just uh, meleeing an enemy, but your melee will trigger something called energy drain, which will actually reduce the cooldown. A lot of people didn't even know this in year one because it really wasn't a thing. Like, it was just really unnoticeable. Um, so, basically, now that it's noticeable again, embrace the void. Now reduces the cool, it uh, triggers energy drain when you get a kill with a grenade or an Nova bomb, but it also restores your health when you get a kill with a grenade or an Nova bomb. So, which is pretty cool because this is now that makes this the only subclass in the game besides Sunbreaker that can heal itself with its melee grenades and super. It's the only, there's only two subclasses in the game that can do that, which is this and Sunbreaker, which I think is pretty cool. I think I I like this subclass and this is probably my favorite warlock subclass now to be honest. I really enjoy this subclass. I really just enjoy, I enjoy playing on it. I think I do pretty well with it. I was doing pretty well with it in trials the other day as well. I think it's just it's definitely it's definitely a lot of fun to use and I think it's definitely a lot better now. The third thing I want to talk to you guys about just real quick uh, before this video ends is the life steal not life steal but the energy drain melee upgrades such as life steal soul rip and i believe energy surge is what they're called they're now all triggered on hit instead of on kill and life life steal and soul rip used to be triggered on kill but now they're triggered on hit so you hit an enemy with with your energy drain you heal yourself you do not have to actually kill them to heal yourself you just have to hit them unlike the sunbreaker where you actually have to kill them uh you just have to hit them to reduce the cooldown of your nova bomb with soul rip you do not have to kill them which i think is pretty cool uh, I do like that addition. I like uh, my favorite is the embrace the void thing, where the grenades will actually heal you and trigger the energy drain because the energy drain is definitely noticeable now. As you can see right there, even in mayhem, you can see the grenade cooldown increases there for a second. But um, anyway, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. Subscribe if you have not already for more Destiny content. And let me know, guys, what do you think of the new Voidwalker? Do you like it? Do you hate it? Do you think it was better before? Do you think it was unnecessary? Do you think uh, personally, I think it was a necessary buff. I, everyone's like, but, but Nova Bomb's always been good. Yeah, Nova Bomb's always been good, but not the subclass itself, the grenades and the melees. There are definitely better grenades and melees out there than there were on the Voidwalker, and I think this is definitely a necessary buff to make this viable in PvP. So, anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. Subscribe if you have not already for more Destiny content, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace.